Now, I want to end with an example to help you see how this works, give you a visual image. Um, so punching people, right? Punching people is bad. Can we agree on that this morning? Great. All right, punching people is bad. Now, let's imagine I punch someone in the face. Hey, uh, actually, Mo, come on up here. I like to punch Mo in the face. <laughs> come on up, Mo. All right. So let's say that Mo, just come on right here. Let's say that Mo is just standing here, and I just punch him in the face. <laughs> now, Mo could say, oh, gosh, that felt really good. Please do it again. All right, he could say that, but you saw how much I hurt him, right? That was bad. It would not be true to call it good. He could say that it was good. It just wouldn't be true. Calling that punch good would be a lie. But could a person take my punch, which, lest you forget what we're dealing with here, is bad and meant for evil, right? Could a person take that punch and use it for their own advantage? Could they make a bad thing work for their good thing? Again, let's say Mo is just standing here, and I just punch him in the face. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah. God is so good <laughs> that he can take the stuff that is bad and hurtful and use it for his purposes, like Moe.